Are you fast enough? Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we'll be counting down our picks for the best racing games of all time. Before we begin, we publish new content every day, so be sure to subscribe. For this list, we test drove everything from go-karts to high-speed futuristic vehicles to see which could stand in the leaderboards. We have addressed the top 10 racing games way back in the past, but with that race to the top spot never ending, we felt it'd be best to update the list. Number 10. Race Driver Grid Known as just Grid in North America, the life of a racer is pretty glamorous, but sometimes it can be fun to share the spotlight. No stranger to more grounded racing games, Codemasters unveiled Grid, combining the high speeds of arcade games with real cars and locations to offer a really nice balance that basically everyone can enjoy. Featuring a plethora of modes, Grid gives a more laid-back feature to break away from the thrilling races in the form of racer team management. With so many great mechanics and concepts like the flashback feature, it's a shame the Grid series hasn't seen a good resurgence. Number 9. F-Zero GX Are the laws of physics getting in your way? Vehicles not fast enough? Well, perhaps F-Zero GX is the game for you, friend. Retaining the series' extremely high speeds and quick reflexes, GX wasn't just a welcome addition to the F-Zero series, it was definitely the best, too. Thanks to the better control scheme of the GameCube controller, the sharp controls were never sharper, and with a huge amount of new game modes and content, F-Zero had basically reached its peak, which is too bad because that was a long time ago. We can only hope that sometime in the future, our favorite captain will falcon punch his way into our hearts once again. Number 8. Midnight Club 3 – Dub Edition Many know Rockstar Games for their Grand Theft Auto series, but not too many know that they once joined the racing game scene too. Applying their knowledge of open-world games, the Midnight Club series carried this feature proudly, combining a booming soundtrack with high-speed arcade racing in semi-real-life locations to explore and race in. Midnight Club 3 was definitely no different, and with even more cars to customize and interesting locations, finding those back alley shortcuts had never been more fun. We'd love to run with the Midnight Club cruise again, but <sighs> something tells us that Rockstar is a little too busy with other stuff these days. Number 7. Wipeout 3 As the title dictates, you're going to be wiping out plenty of times in this game. While at first glance those high-speed futuristic vehicles might look a bit familiar, this PlayStation series managed to make a name for its own. Wipeout 3 pushed the graphics of the PS1 to limits not thought really possible, and the gameplay has aged surprisingly well. Smooth controls will have you speeding along to a very powerful soundtrack, and with loads of power-ups to make your enemies, well, you know, wipe out. While yet again this is a series that hasn't been very active, it has seen a bit of resurgence in the past few years. Number 6. Project Cars 2 The first game in the Project Cars series was already an impressive achievement. What started as an independent production quickly became one of the most impressive, realistic car simulators to date. The sequel, on the other hand, upped the ante in almost every way, with over 180 cars, 46 different tracks based on real-world locations, and some of the most impressive visuals we've ever seen in a video game. On top of all that, you could also pop on a VR headset for a truly immersive experience. Number 5. Burnout 3 – Takedown While many remember Burnout for racing through a cityscape paradise, you'll need to drive a little farther down memory lane to find this gem. Burnout has always been a series where high speeds and aggressive behavior are praised, and Burnout 3 took the latter to a whole new level with the new Takedown system. Whereas the previous entries in the series just gave players an edge in position, Takedown rewards aggressive behavior with boosts and points. Needless to say, gamers have loved the system since its inclusion, and it's even affected another popular EA series. Number 
Number four, Need for Speed Underground 2. Yeah, yeah, you lit it up out there, but remember, that was just a taste. You gotta keep winning to stay. The Need for Speed series is one of gaming's best racing franchises of all time, with over 20 games under its belt, and needless to say, they won't be losing too much speed anytime soon. Still, the real peak of the series definitely came with the second title of the Underground series, featuring not only fully customizable cars to create your own dream Underground Street Racer, but a free-roaming open world map to explore this time. It's stylish, the races are intense, and it had a kick-ass licensed soundtrack. What's not to love? Joe, okay. Maybe I was a little hard on you. Good race. Number three, Gran Turismo 4. Another flagship series for the PlayStation platform, Gran Turismo 4 was one of the swan songs to the series' life on the PS2. Grounded and realistic racing simulation at its best, GT4 brought in an unprecedented amount of cars that would make any enthusiast's jaw hit the floor. With more cars and tracks than ever before, the game still pushed the limits of the PS2 with improved graphics, a crew chief mode, new driving missions, and even more realistic physics to boot. Subsequent entries in the series may have larger selections of cars and better graphics, but they can't stop this monumental achievement in the racing sim genre. Number 2. Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Sometimes you need to switch it up when it comes to racing games, and what better way than with Mario and Friends? With Mario Kart 8's huge success, it didn't seem right to let it just die with the Wii U. So Nintendo dusted it off, applied a fresh coat of wax, and gave a few upgrades before setting the kart racer loose once more. Upgraded visuals, a renewed battle mode, and an enormous amount of tracks and racers. This isn't just the pinnacle of Mario Kart, it's one of the best racing games out there. I mean, it's number two, right? Before we cross the finish line, here are a few honorable mentions. Coming through. Number one, Forza Horizon 3. world is large and vast, but that only makes speed demons all the more eager to cross it all. The Forza Horizon series sets its sights on a fictitious Australian setting this time around, offering a wide range of environments from sandy beaches to lush jungles and sprawling cityscapes, so there's basically something for every racer. With the largest environment for the Horizon series to date, cross-platform play between PC and Xbox One users, and plenty of DLC. Horizon 3 not only has set a precedent for the Forza series, but for racing games in general. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from WatchMojo and subscribe for new videos every day.